Welcome to this Windows channel and this is another highlight of a Fall Creators update in Windows 10. So what's new also in Creators Update? The Task Manager has been updated. Now, if you look at the Task Manager, you can of course ask the Task Manager from here. You can right click somewhere on, the, in, on the, your taskbar and try to get the Task Manager. Now uh, I'm trying to get it from somewhere here on the east side. Uh, here we go, Task Manager. You got a lot of icons here. Uh, one of the new features of the Task Manager in the um, Fall Creators update is uh, the interesting uh, side where the GPU adds a new column. Now here you don't see it for a simple reason that my GPU isn't supported, but there's a new GPU um, update. So if you've got a graphics adapter, you will have GPU written here. It's gonna show you the activity of your graphics adapter which is something new. Uh, up to what point it could be useful, I'm not sure, but it's something that is going to be, um, you know, maybe useful for some gamers, I don't know. It's, it's very um, unique, but it's, you know, at least a detail, one more detail about what's happening. So here it's not there. Uh, you might say, well, you know, why, did they remove it? No, they had said in one of the last few, um, builds that it does not show up for GPUs that are not supported. In this case, um, it didn't work on this computer, so the GPU always showed zero. So they kind of remove it now. So this is one of the things that's new in the task manager. Uh, apart from that, there's a little more uh, things like, for example, if you look at the processes, um, now you will be able to also have the possibility to um, basically check out and uh, see what process is running and you'll be able to use the um, you know the the process that's running and basically limit or you know tell it to save or you know use more clock cycles easier there's a few new options in there so for those that tweak and like to you know look at the different services and the different options in the um, in the panel, you'll be able to easily look at what's running and um, tell processes or tell uh, apps that are running. Look, I want this service or this to have um, you know power limitations, so it's to save power, for example. Or um, you'll be able to also you know tell it that you want a higher priority. Uh, a few things that are changing. You know, not a lot changed in here but just enough. Uh, also the look, when you look at the processes for the different apps, uh, it will be easier now for you to see when you click the different processes that are all involved with it. Because before, if you'd actually open it up, you'd have a few things showing up, but not everything. Now it's more detailed. So every time something is on, you not only see that this app is on. So for example, if I use Edge right now, you can actually look at edge but you see here it as a number seven and you can click and it's going to tell you hey you've got all of this that is actually working so runtime broker user interface service microsoft edge manager edge content process uh, google which is a page that's open uh, the uh, chakra uh, compiler uh, browser broker once again here uh, browse extensions here because i've gotten extensions or not so all of that is now separated where before it was kind of just jam packed into a couple of things and that's it. So um, some improvements here, you know, I think uh, for people that use the, uh, the task manager, um, a few interesting improvements, of course, some cosmetic improvements, uh, but still, you know, um, maybe it'd be fun to have a, uh, I think it'd be fun to have a, uh, um, a, a dark team for the task manager and uh, also maybe, um, I don't know, uh, a task manager has been, you know, um, revamped a little bit over time, but I, I would say that one of the things that I would like maybe to have here is uh, I think it's, it's due for a kind of a remake uh, eventually. Um, it's getting old in the way that it's displaying information. Of course, 
the good old stuff like the CPU uh, performance and, and, and graphics, the memory used, um, the disk use of, you know, what's usage and um, Ethernet, Wi-Fi and so on. All of that is in here. And so, um, you know, th there's still a lot of what it looked like before, but a lot of, um, you know, kind of some new stuff also in here. So uh, basically, uh, we'll have a few new details. So you'll have a little, a little more information about what app and what uh, processes each app are actually requiring. And you'll have also uh, a, a view of your GPU is what mostly what the task manager will now have in the fall creators update. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you so much for following us on this Windows channel.